The moon, our closest celestial neighbor, has captivated humanity for millennia. Its serene glow illuminates our nights, inspiring countless tales and fueling scientific curiosity. For generations, we have gazed upon this luminous orb, pondering its mysteries and dreaming of the day we might set foot upon its surface. The moon's gravitational influence orchestrates the tides, impacting life on Earth in profound ways. It also stabilizes our planet's axial tilt, ensuring a climate conducive to life. The moon is approximately 238,855 miles from Earth, a distance that seems vast. Imagine traveling at 60 miles per hour. It would take about 166 days of continuous driving to reach it. That's like driving non-stop for almost half a year. However, thanks to the ingenuity of scientists and engineers, we have developed spacecraft capable of making the journey in just a few days. This remarkable achievement underscores the rapid advancements in space travel technology. In 1969, Apollo 11 made history by landing the first humans on the moon. Neil Armstrong's iconic words, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind, encapsulated the monumental significance of this achievement. The Apollo missions were a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. They provided invaluable insights into the moon's composition, history and potential for future exploration. Today, space agencies around the globe are embarking on ambitious missions to explore the moon. NASA's Artemis program aims to establish a sustainable presence on the lunar surface, serving as a gateway for future missions to Mars and beyond. The moon holds immense potential for scientific discoveries, resource utilization and even space tourism. As we delve deeper into lunar exploration, we gain a greater understanding of our own planet and our place in the cosmos. The dream of reaching the moon has evolved into a stepping stone towards a future filled with extraordinary possibilities. Right, so getting to the moon isn't just about having a look around, is it? It's about seeing what we can actually do, like pushing ourselves to the max. Think of the moon as a giant science lab in space. We can test out new gadgets and plans there, stuff we'll need to go further into the solar system. Plus, by checking out the moon, we can learn loads about how our solar system and even our own planet started. And get this, there's actually water ice on the moon. That means we could use it for future missions, like a pit stop on the way to somewhere even more far out. Everything we learn from going to the moon helps us get ready for bigger trips, like going to Mars, maybe even further. Who knows, one day people might even live in space. That's pretty mind-blowing, isn't it? 